One, two, three, four, five. You're, okay, you're going. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I'm gonna pretend to get hit by a car. <laughs> Come on, let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Come on, get speedy! Get speedy! You girl! What do you think about BBL? You like BBL? Yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about. That's some nice, that's some nice inspirational quotation mark. Come on, let's go. We'll find more people. Yeah, yeah. We're all there's a lot of people down here. You, you sir, yeah. sir. Woo. What are you saying? No, no. Yeah. Yeah. for episode 5 of The Rundown with me, Geo Nugget, mostly known as Geo. But first, it's time for my lunch break. I'll save this one for later. <clears throat> first on the agenda, we're going to talk about the Green to Gold Tournament. There's going to be a lot of new things, and we're going to find out when that thing is going to happen. So uh, you better you better buckle up. You better buckle up. It's going to get really exciting. It's going to be a roller coaster of fun. I was so hungry. So we're also going to talk about people. People basically being Crimson Flash returning to BBL. Isn't that great? Isn't that so cool? I hope it's cool. It's so cool. Okay. Wait, what? Oh yeah. I don't know. Okay, let's move on to the next thing. Okay. First on the agenda is... Um... Oh yeah, the green... To gold tournament and about the green to gold tournament is gloomy well first off gloomy has been officially suspended from season one of Firestar and pretty much all things BBL, but you'll probably still see him there, because he'll probably be in the audience crying about how he can't play anymore. But, he is also completely disqualified from the green. To gold. Tournament. Which means that his opponent, Fruit by the Foot, automatic me automatically moves on to the next round. Congratulations. You got a free pass, you floater. Probably would have lost. Loser. Loser. You think you're a tough guy, huh? You think you do, do, do. Oh. Oh. Dramatic. And we are ready to do more stuff about BBL. Are you ready for more rundownness of downing of run? The rundown with me, Geo, Geo Nuggets. Yeah. All right. So I'd like to introduce a new character. We got our newest, newest guest, Betty. You got something to say, Betty? Great. Bye, Betty! Okay, 
So we're gonna talk about Unmasked. Y'all know him, right? We announced that he would be disappearing from every single match in about three episodes. Or probably all of them. We probably said he wasn't gonna be at a match in a lot of episodes. But he's officially back from stuff. So he's gonna be here so he won't have to do stuff. And instead of doing that stuff, he's gonna participate in the matches. Congratulations, Unmasked. He's right there. Show him, show him that. Show, 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 show. Hi, Unmasked. Okay, now bring it back to me. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So now, since he's gonna be back now, we're gonna talk about um a crimson flash. Which is a person. Okay, so then about Crimson Flash. Since he's returning, he also had like a, a match last Saturday, which means that he added another win to his undefeated score, which which means he has three knockouts, three wins. He's undefeated, which means he has a big record of good scoring. So congratulations, Crimson Flash. Betty congratulates you. Betty gives you approval. Michael! We gotta go somewhere, Michael's Michael! Come on, Michael! You gotta get out of bed! You gotta get out of bed! We gotta sell more! We gotta sell more! We gotta make millions! We gotta make a movie! We gotta make everything! We gotta make an army! We gotta do a lot! Go on, Michael! We're not done yet! We gotta take over the world! We gotta go on adventures! Like Rick and Morty! We gotta go everywhere! We'll kill My Little Pony! We'll kill anime! We'll do everything! We can do this! Whoa. And we are back from thing that we make thing and we film things so you can watch thing. And now, but just before we recap episode 9 of Firestarter, we're going to talk about Sonic Bencraft of DDC. Okay, so Sonic Bencraft is number... Thirteen in the Bandicoot Boxing League ranks. So what do you think about that, Betty? Um, I think that's really good. Good job, Sonic. Thank you, Betty, for your commentary. Okay, Betty and I are gonna interview Sonic, who's number. Hello. Thirteen in the ranking. So we're going to talk about two matches regarding episode nine of Firestarter. Sonic's most infamous match, the opener of episode nine, which is where Step Abuela went up against him and ended up knocking him out within two minutes of the first round. So Sonic, how do you feel looking back on that match? Uh, sad. Mhm. Mm so are you ashamed, disappointed in yourself? What else? Yes, all of them. Okay. Alright. Well, let's ask another question. Do you feel like you'll improve? Yeah. And one more question. How fast are your reactions? Fast. Just fast. Really? Mm-hmm. You very clearly lied. Okay, so now let's move on to the... Alright. Okay, here we go. Like music for the fire coming in tonight. Making his way to the ring, hailing from America with the record of zero wins, three losses, zero draws, and zero knockouts. 
He is the 22 ranked boxer in BBL. Step Abuela. The 20th ranked boxer here tonight making his presence well known in the arena here. All right, Very we'll good. Lord, man, I gotta say, I'm excited. Aren't we all excited for here tonight? Bandicoot and his opponent making his way to the ring. Hailing from the UK with the record of one win, zero losses, zero draws, and zero KOs. He is the number seventh ranked and BBL Sonic Bancraft. Number seventh ranked boxer here in the Bandicoot Boxing League. All right, let me start the game and we'll get this on its way. The referee cooker here tonight doing an outstanding job with his presence and the fight is begun with the two fighters getting straight into it a hook from step of all right here we go oh my goodness oh oh stop the time stop the time all right there you go oh we got jumping right there yeah, I can't be jumping like that in the BBL ring. Someone got disqualified that way. In fact, I think he spied the ticket booth. Oh my goodness! Yo, it, it looks like we're looking at a first round knockout. First round knockout. Unbelievable! First round knockout in just a few seconds. Man, Sonic Bincraft, he is rocked right now. He is Absolute rocked. Absolute aggression. There is no messing around in this place. There's no messing around in the fighting boxing league. There's no messing around. Oh, oh, oh. oh this is Steph oh, Abuela's right. first ever VR match. Him. It looks like he's finally breaking his losing streak. He's trying to get in. Going straight for the knockout. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Unbelievable. Oh, oh, stop the time. Stop the time. The rest counting, he's counting, the rest counting. That was actually crazy. First round knockout. That's the first time we ever seen an actual first round knockout. Man, wait, Abuela, Abuela. Can we talk about that match? Yeah. What was your mind game? Uh, what was like your mindset during that? That was incredible. First round knockout. I was pretty surprised that I was getting so many hits. Yeah, that was honestly crazy. Sonic Bancraft, what do you have to say about it? Oh, oh, okay. All right. Give a hint for these two boxers. That was actually crazy. I wasn't expecting a first round knockout like that. Man, it looks like Abuela's finally Abuela. broken his losing streak. Congra congratulations for him. Losing streak broken. Less than a minute. All right. So let's move on to our next discussion, which will be regarding uh, the lower mid card, which was Giorno versus Aflox. This one was a pretty long one, don't you think, Sonic? Yeah. It wasn't as long as my first match, though. Fast reactions. <clears throat> so, what did you think watching it, Sonic? Um, I think um that it was just super long. Mhm. Mm and I took a while. I missed. That missed. Okay, so we know for a fact that it lasted four rounds up until Giorno won by knockout against f Flox, giving Giorno the win and boosting his reputation. Do you feel Giorno is going to rise to the top eventually? Um, maybe someday. Well, you know, people, people as boxers do change from time to time. 
So you never know what's really going to happen in the future. So what do you think is going to happen to you, Sonny? Nothing. Really? Or something just happened to you, you got hit by a snowball. Unexpected. That, that missed. Did that miss? <laughs> yeah. Mm-mm-mm. Mm. mm, mm, mm. mm. You got bamboozled. Thank you, Betty. All right, let's move on to our next clip. Making his way to the ring, hailing from America with the record of three wins, four losses, one draw, and two knockouts. He is the number eighth ranked in BBL. F Blocks! F Blocks He needs the Water vaccine. Needs Give me one boy second. Water boy needs green. Water boy needs green. And his okay, opponent. Hey, Water boy. Get the Please do not cuss. This is being recorded. The match card. Oh shit. Oh shit, yeah. Shit, I'm not. Bandicoot, Bandicoot, guess what, guess what, guess what? Oh no, do I need to come out of here? Oh no, oh no. Ow, you bitch. Already in the ring. Already in the ring. Hailing from Norway. With the record of one win, one loss, zero draws and one knockout. He is the number ninth boxer in BBL. Jorno or Jomongader. All right, Jorno. This is your first high card match here. Uh, what do you think about it? Yeah. Any words? I can't. I can't hear you. Uh, uh, all right. Can you hear me? All right, F blocks. There one was a lad that looked and like me. <laughs> Any thoughts? Oh, no. I'm gonna win. Okay, referee cooker. Okay, about my instructions at all times. The venue's at all times. Touch guys back to your corner. We're on the bell, guys. Remember, this match is sponsored by the breakout coming this winter 2021 by Hammett Games. All right, here we go. We do apologize for the technical difficulties that we have been having here at the Bandicoot Boxing League. We hope it wasn't too much of a bother to everybody here, but I would like to hear a heck yeah if it didn't bother you. <laughs> Alright, we're hearing some heck yeahs. Let's hear something else from the audience. Who do you think is going to win this one? Tell us in game chat. Who do you think is going to win Room the chat. fight here tonight? Alright, we see Jorno here. He is basically an outboxer oh. here. Likes to keep his distance. We got F-Blocks. I'd say he's a boxer puncher. Basically, uh, all-rounder, really. Textbook. F Blocks is a aggressive fighter, as well as Jorman Gunder. I fought against Jorman Gunder many times. They can't oh. Jorno, and he is a fighter that you should not be underestimating. His power and reach is unbelievable of this fighter, and I believe that he has a good chance here to win. 
You're but right. That is just me. F blocks. He definitely has most the the most experience here in BBL. More w w uh, losses than wins, though. Not entirely in his favor. Well, maybe that is about to all change. Ooh. Well, I'm not sure. It looks like Jorno's gonna be winning this round here. He's got so many body hits in. Just wearing down on F Flux's body. Oh! oh! F Flux, big straight, big F -Flux straight. With the right hand. We got 15 seconds Both left in round are one. Playing very defensively as oh! F Flux tried to go for a body shot, but did not work with the right hand from Jorno. We got five seconds left. Four. Five Three, on the clock two, and round number one. one. Oh. And that is, is the end of round number one. Heading into reset, round number uh, two. Stop, stop the, the time and reset. Please. Yeah, there you go. Man, Thank I you. thought we were about to see another round one knockout, but f Blocks pulled through. f Blocks, even though he may be on a losing streak, the man does not lose his senses when fighting against his prime opponent here. Let's take a look at the results of uh, episode 8. We saw f Blocks in the main event getting knocked out on round 4. Dorno winning by TKO because I believe his opponent was having too much lag. Oh! Unbelievable. Wouldn't say that would be the best knockout, but it's a knockout nonetheless. Alright, let's wait for the ref. All about guys. And we're off for round number two. Two minutes into round number two. Both fighters are playing very defensive here. You're trying right, to get the better of one of them. F Flux is pretty low right now. Just being the water boy that he is. Oh, oh, oh! Stay hydrated. By Big Conker. exchange. That's... Big exchange here. F Flux oh. is trying. Oh! Left that looked like it hit the chest. For, for Jordo. Ooh. Oh! F Flux was going F -Flux low. Jordo was just looking went for a it. A little bit too down and got him straight on the button. One minute and 20 seconds left here. Both fighters are now. F Flux is trying to keep his distance here. Not throwing, just not seeming to throw a single jab at his opponent. Ooh. There we go. Cooker is looking oh, very ooh. intensely, being the referee that he is. He knows, oh! He knows what he is doing. He has been here many times, coaching the fights, making sure they go straight as they want to, as we want them to be. Everybody here 15, is just 50 watching in anticipation. Yeah, this may not be the event, but we still have a decent crowd here. Ooh! Man, Jono's getting a lot of hooks in. I want, I, you know what? I want to start a topic during the middle of this fight. Green to gold, the good tournament for all rookies around the world are waiting in anticipation for that event. I, myself, am a rookie, and I cannot personally wait for the fight that's going to come to me. My opponent here is going to be Stormy. Stormy is over there on your left, just waiting there, looking at the fight. <laughs> and uh, I say, uh, from the looks of him, I think he's going to be giving me a good challenge. And I like a good challenge. I like the people who uh, want to fight. I'm more of a respectful fighter. And that's person. round two. And that, that is the end of what? Huh? Oh, that wasn't the Boris Johnson, Johnson that you thought. It was one that like had a deep voice oh. and he was uh, like okay. putting his uh, mic in his mouth. That is the end of round number two. All right. Yes, that is. Man, speaking of the GTG tournament, uh, we're basically having American and UK boxers. Not really that many nationalities, but they're still talented nevertheless. I'm definitely looking forward to your fight against Stormy. I wonder who's going to prevail in that and go to the semifinals. Well, that depends. Um, oh, I, F Blocks is beating up his corner man has, right now, Adam that, Gray. Has that little technique. I'm waiting for someone who has that dodge, all them fast punches, hard hitter. Okay. That's who I'm looking okay, for. Okay, on the bell. On the bell, guys. On the bell. F Blocks shouldn't really be hitting yeah, Adam Gray up. like that. On his match is coming up. That could be a fine. Oh, man, here we go. Round three. 
This is the longest match we had so far during this episode. Uh, David, um, uh, we are going to ask you to please do not be disrespectful and start disrespecting our good ref here. This will be your first and last warning. Any more disrespect and you will be removed. We do not yeah. take disrespect here at the Bandicoot Boxing League and you should very well know that. We do take fun and jokes here. Uh, slight insults, but if it gets a little too extreme Yeah, slight then... insults. Just, just the good stuff, but no, we don't take any of that uh, mumbo jumbo. Alright, Conquer, please out of my view. Water boy. We got one minute left in third round. Not a lot of action going on. Jorno, he's still going for the body not shots there. Not a lot there. of action going here. This, this ooh. just... Ooh. Man, it looks like Both Flux just... are trying to get in on each other. Above oh, TV. oh, oh, Flux! He's getting oh. close. He's getting close. Flux getting behind. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh man, F Flox, he's trying to close the distance here. That's what he needs to do to get through Jornal's reach. F oh. knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. Get behind his opponent. That's where he's 30 seconds vulnerable. left. Don't turn your back to oh. him. Oh. Oh. oh, he's getting more aggressive now. Man, things are starting to pick up here. Round number three. Oh. F Flox oh. is going in. Oh. Oh man, just think we got That'd two more insane matches. That'll be boxers. at this caliber. Maybe even more. Ah, uh, to be believable, these two boxers. Oh, oh! Five seconds left. Uh, Four. Three. He's getting in two, on the blocks. One. Unbelievable. Stop the fight. Round number three was a hassle. It was a brawl from these two fighters here tonight. Unbelievable. Seemingly to change his own tactic against himself. Jorman Gunner. Oh, oh, oh. F-Box is low. He is low. He is rocked. Oh, Jorno could be looking at a knockout low. right here. If he wants to win this fight or at least try to survive it, he will have to try and get the better. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. oh he's low. Him. He's low. But he's rocked. He's rocked. He's rocked. He's oh, going no. to get knocked out. He's, he's playing real defensive here. His hands up, trying to block any oh, angle. Oh, oh. And gentlemen, the winner in the mid card in the fourth round by KO, Jormungandr. Jordan Gunder has just knocked out F Blocks with a swift Man. motion as he was rocked. Making his way to the ring, hailing from America with the record of three wins, four losses, one draw, and two knockouts. He is the number eighth ranked in BBL. F Blocks! F He needs the vaccine. Give me one second. Water boy needs green. And his opponent. Hey, water boy. Get the. Please do not cuss. This is being recorded. The match card. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah. Shit. I'm not. Bandicoot, Bandicoot, guess what, guess what, guess what? Oh no, do I need to come out here? Oh no, I know. I'm dead. Oh, no. oh, no. Bitch. <laughs> Already in the ring. Would you like me to come out here? Already in the ring. Yeah, I don't mind. Hailing from Norway. With the record of one win, one loss, zero draws, and one knockout. He is the number ninth boxer in BBL. Jorno or Jomongader.
All right, Jorno. This is your first high card match here. Uh, what do you think about it? Yeah. Any words? I can't. I can't hear you. Uh, 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 all right, can you hear me? F blocks. There one. Was a lot that looked and like me. <laughs> Any thoughts? Oh, no. I'm gonna win. Okay, <laughs> referee cooker. Okay, I buy my instructions at all times. The venue stuff at all times. Touch guys, back to the corner, run the bell, guys. Remember, this match is sponsored is by the breakout coming wide. this winter right 2021 now. by Hammett Games. All right, here we go. We do apologize for the technical difficulties that we have been having here at the Bandicoot Boxing League. We no, hope it wasn't too much of a oh. to everybody here, but I would like to hear a heck yeah if it didn't bother you. <laughs> Alright, we're hearing some heck yeahs. Let's hear something else from the audience. Who do you think is going to win this one? Tell us in game chat. Who do you think is going to win Room the chat. fight here tonight? All right, we see Jorno here. He is basically an outboxer here. Likes to keep his distance. We got F blocks. I'd say he's a boxer puncher. Basically, uh, all rounder really. Textbook. F blocks is a aggressive fighter, as well as Jorman Gunder. I fought against Jorman Gunder many times. AKA oh. Jorno. And he is a fighter that you should not be underestimating. His power and reach is unbelievable of this fighter. And I believe that he has a good chance here to win. You're but right. That is just oh. me. F blocks. He definitely has most the the most experience here in BBL. More w w uh, losses than wins, though. Not entirely in his favor. Well, maybe that is about to all change. Ooh. Well, I'm not sure. It looks like Jorno is going to be winning this round here. He's got so many body hits in. Just wearing down on F Flux's body. Oh, oh! F Flux, big straight, big straight. With the right hand. We got 15 seconds Both left in round are one. Playing very defensively as oh. Fox tried to go for a body shot, but did not work with the right hand from Jordan. We got five seconds left. Four, five three, on the clock two, and round number one. one. Oh. And that is the end of round number one. Heading into reset, round number uh, two. Stop, stop the, the time and reset. Please. Yeah, there you go. Man, Thank I you. thought we were about to see another round one knockout, but F Blocks pulled through. F Blocks, even though he may be on a losing streak, the man does not lose his senses when fighting against his prime opponent here. Let's take a look at the results of uh, episode eight. We saw F Blocks in the main event getting knocked out on round four. Dorno winning by TKO because I believe his opponent was having too much lag. Oh! Unbelievable. Wouldn't say that would be the best knockout, but it's a knockout nonetheless. Alright, let's wait for the ref. <laughs> All about guys. And we're off for round number two. Two minutes into round number two. Both fighters are playing very defensive here. You're trying right to get the better of one of them. F Flux is pretty low right now. Just being the water boy that he is. Oh, oh, oh! Stay hydrated. By Big Conker. exchange. That's... Big exchange here. F Flux oh. is trying. Oh! Left that looked like it hit the chest. First for Jordo. Ooh. Oh! F Flux was going F -Flux low. Jordo was looking went for it. A little bit too down and got him straight on the button. One minute and 20 seconds left here. Both fighters are now. F blocks is trying to keep his distance here. Not throwing, just not seeming to throw a single jab at his opponent. Ooh. There we go. Cooker is looking oh, very ooh. intensely, being the referee that he is. He knows. Oh! 
He knows what he is doing. He has been here many times coaching the fights, making sure they go straight as they want to, as we want them to be. Everybody here is just to 50 watching in anticipation. Yeah, this may not be the event, but we still have a decent crowd here. Ooh! Man, Jono's getting a lot of hooks in. I want, I, you know what? I want to start a topic during the middle of this fight. Green to gold, the good tournament for all rookies around the world are waiting in anticipation for that event. I, myself, am a rookie, and I cannot personally wait for the fight that's going to come to me. My opponent here is going to be Stormy. Stormy is over there on your left, just waiting there, looking at the fight. <laughs> and uh, I say, uh, from the looks of him, I think he's going to be giving me a good challenge. And I like a good challenge. I like the people who uh, want to fight. I'm more of a respectful And that's round two. And that is the end of what huh oh that wasn't what the boris, boris johnson, johnson that you thought it was one that like had a deep voice oh. and he was uh like okay. putting his uh, mic apologize. in his mouth that is the end of round number two all right yes that is man speaking of the gtg tournament uh we're basically having american and uk boxers not really that many nationalities, but they're still talented, nevertheless. I'm definitely looking forward to your fight against Stormy. I wonder who's going to prevail in that and go to the semifinals. Well, that depends. Um, oh, Fbox is beating up his corner man right now, Adam that, Gray. Has that little technique. I'm waiting for someone who has that dodge, all them fast punches, hard hitter. Okay. That's who I'm looking okay, for. Okay, on the bell. On the bell, guys. On the bell. F-Block shouldn't really be hitting Adam Gray like that. His match is coming up. That could be a fine. Oh man, here we go. Round three. This is the longest match we had so far during this episode. Uh, David, um, uh, we are going to ask you to please do not be disrespectful and start disrespecting our good ref here. This will be your first and last warning. Any more disrespect and you will be removed. We do not yeah. take disrespect here at the Bandicoot Boxing League, and you should very well know that. We do take fun and jokes here. Uh, slight insults, but if it gets a little too extreme, yeah, slight then... insults. Just, just the good stuff, but no, we don't take any of that uh, mumbo-jumbo. All right, Conquer, please out of my view. Water boy. We got one minute left in third round. Not a lot of action going on. Jorno, he's still going for the body not shots there. Oh, man, it looks like Both F Lux just. Are trying to get in on each other. Oh, 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 F Lux. He's getting oh. close. He's getting close. F Lux getting behind. Oh, oh. oh. oh man, F Lux. He's trying to close the distance here. That's what he needs to do to get through Jorno's reach. Oh. Knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing, getting behind his opponent, that's where he's 30 most seconds left. Don't turn your back to oh, him, oh, 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 he's getting more aggressive now. Man, what things are starting to pick up here. Clock in round number three. Oh, 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 Fbox is going in. Oh, oh man, just think, we got oh, two more insane matches that will be boxers. at this caliber. Maybe even more. Oh, to be believable, these two boxers. Oh. oh. Five seconds left. Yo, yo Four. Three. Is getting in on two. Blocks. One. Unbelievable. Stop the fight. Round number three was a hassle. It was a brawl from these two fighters here tonight. Unbelievable. Seemingly to change his own tactic against himself. Jorman Gunner. Oh, oh, oh F-Box is low. He is low. He is rocked. Oh, Jorno could be looking at a knockout low. right here. If he wants to win this fight or at least try to survive it, he will have to try and get the better Oh, ooh, Gunner. Ooh, by, ooh, oh, he's low. Him. He is low. But he's rocked. He's rocked. He's rocked. He's oh, going no. to get knocked out. He's playing real defensive here. He's hands up trying to block any Oh, oh. oh. One, one, it two, is three, over. Round number four with just one minute and 16 right. Right. seconds left on the clock. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, new winner in the mid-card.
in the fourth round by KO. Jormungadr. Yordaman Gunder has just knocked out F Brox with a swift Man. motion wow. as he was rocked. Where the two? One. All right, folks. So let's get to our last little piece of news, and this news is going to be about uh, there's a new team forming. The top two competitors in BBL Band Boxing League. Uh, Crimson Flash and Conquer have combined to make the ultimate duo! Divide and Conquer. Divide and Conquer. So far, they're the best performing team in all of BBL. And that's about it. Bye! And last words from Betty. Betty Army! Yeah! Three Bettys.